again, I'm going to remind everybody, my views are my own, and I don't speak for anyone on the, the committee. But, the, but that is exactly how I think about it. So just instead of um, that, let's go back to the June SCP where if you remember, or maybe you don't, I'll, I'll remind, in the June summary of economic projections, there were two more rate hikes projected for this year. Then in July, we took one of those rate hikes, and another one in the September SEP was the median outlook. But the bond market has tightened quite considerably, over about 36 basis points since we met in September. Well, that is equivalent to about a rate hike, right? And so then the need to do tightening additionally is not there. So from my own perspective, that's what I look at. You know, that my job as I see it, our job as, as I see it, is not to tighten, just do our part. It's to watch financial conditions. Because monetary policy works, we, we raise the funds rate, and it, it, it moves through all the other interest rates. If financial conditions are sufficiently tight, our work is not necessary, because we don't need to boost them more. Yeah, Rich, does that make sense? Absolutely. And Rich Clarida said today that the rise in yields actually does the Fed's job for it. Would you agree with that? Would you sympathize with that kind of sentiment? That is actually how it works, right? If financial conditions tighten, I mean, one of the things that's happened in the last 90 days and certainly in the last uh, few weeks is that financial markets have collectively seem to take on board a variety of things. But one of the things that I heard from many commentators and many of the market outreach I do is that they, they have a general understanding now that we are committed at the FOMC to keeping rates higher for longer in an effort to bring inflation fully back down to 2%. And that recognition, along with all the other factors we could put in a list about why bond yields have risen, are affecting certainly the financial conditions and the tightening. And I see that as a as positive outcome, that we would have tighter financial conditions, because then we can really get the job done of putting inflation back to rest. 